last one is super rare before my second whitetail great one. My second whitetail great one took forever. I mean, it was literally probably a two year grind. Should it have taken that long? No, probably not. But did it take that long? Yeah, it did. that long because he wouldn't spawn that's not really the whole reason I, I was slacking a little bit but you get my point this white tail took 4,679 kills and you may be thinking that's not even really that bad I mean it's long but I've heard of worse you probably have you see my skill involving consistency it's very short tempered I'll stay consistent with something for like maybe two weeks max. You can't stick me on something longer than that because I will get burnt out so quickly. And that is what kept happening with my whitetail. But I'm not going to completely blame it on that because he could have showed up quicker. Maybe if he did show up sooner, I probably wouldn't have gotten that super rare. So I'm not going to fully blame him as you know, giving me a bad grind. It was it was a little long, but it wasn't all that bad. Now you also have to think about the fact that in between that time frame, there was a couple other things that happened. You know, we got the fallow deer great one. We got the red deer. Oh, no we didn't. I lied. Wait, yes we did. We got the red deer great one. We got the black bear great one. And we got a couple new maps. With this white tail taking his sweet time, I was not going to sit there and wait until he spawns before I do all these new things. So in between that time frame from when I got my first white tail great one, which took 1085 kills by the way, also a big wreck, he was pretty good. He came in one of my favorite zones. He came in, you know, a fairly short amount of kills. And it was, you know, not that long. It was a pretty quick grind. But anyways, in between that time, from when I got my first white tail great one, which was my first great one ever, I managed to get a red deer great one, three moose great ones, and a fallow great one, all before this second white tail decided to spawn. Honestly though, the grind wasn't that terrible, but another reason that he took so long was because my white tail broke. Literally broke. When I was at like probably 2500 kills, and I literally could not get any response no matter what i did i mean i was searching from top to bottom and i could not find any zones and i didn't know what was happening so i left that alone for like months but i got back on it i got back on it okay and once i did that i ended up shooting again on my last remaining zones and i went to a zone i hadn't checked in a while and i found three zones stacked full of bucks two of them had only bucks and one of them was just a separate herd i did shoot a female piebald i remember that once i did that i found three zones so i don't know what happened there or how that fixed it but i'm happy it did now what i will say i got really lucky with this guy because he was a big rack but he wasn't just any old big rack. He scored 640 plus, which was amazing. Really happy about that. And when I first spotted him, I knew he was wide, but I didn't know he was that wide. That stream, my mic decided to not work, which was, you know, per usual. Are we surprised? Not really. But anyways, that one was a pretty fun stream. I mean, we had iBuy popped in, and we had quite a few people there. So it was really nice to take him down in front of everyone. It was scary because the gun that I used made it so that he took forever to drop. But anyways, besides that, it was fun. And also a little bit stressful because he took so long to spawn like I said, but it was a really rewarding feeling, especially after he scored 640 plus, because that really made it feel like it was worth it the whole time. So, am I upset that he took a fairly long time? Not really. I mean, it would have been nice if he showed up a little quicker, but had I had gotten him sooner, would I have a super rare white tail? Probably not, but you never know. You really never know. I do have a video on that. In case you didn't know, that super rare was a max scoring, I think? for the small diamond rack and it was an albino so he was pretty sweet i did have a video on it but i wouldn't be upset if you didn't see it because i've privated a few times because frankly 
it kind of sucks. <laughs> but I do have a short on it, so you can go see that if you really want to see him. Anyway, he was quite the experience. Super happy I finally got him though. And um, what the heck? You know, I'm gonna be honest again. I got him a little while ago, <laughs> but um, I've been slacking a little on the uploads. But. I did get that short out as soon as I shot him. So, I got that on the okay. Videos, though, the longer ones, they're a little rough. But hey, at least I did something. Half my videos end up public for a couple days and then back into my private section. So, anyways, that was my experience on my second great one white tail. Currently, I have at least one of every species that has a great one in a great one. The only thing I need is black bear right now, so that's probably what I'll be working on. So right now I'm doing bears on SRP. Hopefully that great one will spawn soon, and I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.